Hello, everybody. Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter live from the Mayhem Studios in Pittsburgh, PA. With today's Mayhem Minute, uh, today we're going to talk about the big news from WrestleZone.com. Uh, the breaking news yesterday, uh, right before we went to uh, 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 recording the Wrestling Mayhem show on Tuesday night. Samoa Joe uh, is uh, apparently leaving TNA, uh, announced on Twitter, I believe his own Twitter, last night. Uh, and of course, the VP of Talent Relations for TNA, according to WrestleZone, uh, confirmed this as well. Um, it's really funny because I was actually... Consider I was actually sitting down at a Starbucks talking wrestling with somebody uh, and selling them on Samoa Joe of his debut, Samoa Joe of those days when the X division was in the main event with Christopher Daniels and uh, and AJ Styles and tremendous matches they had then, or even Samoa Joe and Kurt Angle the first three times, right? That first angle they they did together. Um, and and he's definitely been flat over the years. It's like Samoa Joe has lost his identity. Um, but uh, it, I'm kind of more happy that he's leaving. So hopefully the next thing is going to be better. Uh, I, 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 I feel sick because I, I don't think he's been with TNA for 10 years. He has a body of work in TNA. And I don't think he's going to WWE. Um, there's a comment. Justin Labar was actually saying on Twitter last night uh, that, uh, you know, he's, you know, somebody asked, is he coming to WWE? They're like, not in a wrestling capacity. And I don't think so. I think he'd be a tremendous trainer, probably. Um, but I I would be very surprised if uh, he popped up in an NXT or something uh, and they started to work him into things. I, I just... Uh, it, <laughs> I know we have outside the box guys right now, like a Kevin Steen, but I, I really just don't think that uh, Samoa Joe fits in in TNA, and and sadly is potentially past his prime. You never know. Maybe he could get into something like that. Maybe he starts doing Ring of Honor, and just like just like AJ Styles, just like Evan Bourne, Matt Seidel, we're seeing this other side that we haven't seen for so long because they've been maybe stifled by the company they're in. Tell me what you think, Samoa Joe. Where should he go from here? What do you think about him leaving TNA? Did you know TNA still exists? Let me know on the comments on YouTube, at Mayhem Show, or at Sorgatron on the Twitter. I'd love to hear your thoughts about the Samoa Joe situation. Props to Russell Zone. Uh, I read those guys all the time. Friends of the show, Justin Labar, and the guys over at Chair Shot Reality. Um, so with that, Mike Sorg, check out everything. WrestlingMayhemShow.com. We got tremendous shows. Jessica James of uh, Shimmer and Shine, I think we were talking about, uh, had some great tidbits about her uh, time in Japan. And and what what training did over there um, and all kinds of other fun stuff. And of course, Wrestling Mayhem Show with our Mayhem Mania thought experiment over at WrestlingMayhemShow.com launching this morning. So until next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at SorgatronMedia.com.